Oh, thank you so much, gents. We are back in the kitchen to cook something that won't break the budget. In fact, this could be one of the least expensive meals you'll make, and it is exquisite. And it really does reinforce the notion that the right ingredients, the right quality ingredients, can create something special. You don't need too much. And of course, we are working around our beautiful African gold extra virgin olive oil, which is exquisite. I'm going to need a partner in crime for this one. But what I love about this exquisite product that every blissful batch is pressed with love and cured to perfection. And this recipe is nothing short of bliss in itself. Our spicy black garlic pasta. An exploration of flavors that make for the perfect low budget weeknight dinner, as I said, ready in under 20 minutes, if you do it mm. right. So Raul, you're gonna be taking care of the important parts, yeah, young friend. Yeah, man. Um, really, really simple. So we've got the black garlic, which as I understand it, is, it's been cured. Mm. So it's an aged cured garlic, so you can imagine how that flavor develops. Oh, yeah. Takes away some of that like overpowering punch of garlic. You can smell it like that. It's kind of got a weird roastiness mm. to it. I, I, have a feeling that the, uh, I have a feeling that the flavors have been able to develop to a point that's just gonna work. Okay. Um, then we've obviously got our fish and salt and pepper. So what yeah. you've got there in the pan, you're going to put uh, the black garlic, the fish, uh -huh. and the um, anchovies is the fish that I'm Anchovy using, okay. obviously, which cool. has obviously got its nice, beautiful And oil, straight um, on the pan or any oil for Straight this? on the pan, okay. and you're going to actually use the water to create a bit of a sauce in the moment. Right, okay. Then add a bit of a water to Ooh, that. Flavors already just immediately emerging out of this. And you can put the whole, whole that's a half a cup of water. All right. You can possibly Play turn more. the heat down a little bit. <laughs> and you'll see immediately the fish and the garlic start to break down. And the idea here is to, oh, smell that garlic, Ooh. buddy. Get a smell of that camera. Yeah, get come a smell on. of that. Get it into your... <laughs> Every TV should have wow. a little funnel that can just <laughs> push out the Oh, honestly, the smell. man, this is giving me freshness. It's giving me the surrealness of the garlic, but at the same time, somewhat of like a tropical feel. I think mm. that's that island vibe coming from, obviously, the anchovies that, you, that you've added, man. Exquisite. So you've got awesome. the salty, you've got the strong yeah. flavors of the garlic, and almost just mash that down and break those okay. down. Obviously, after a little bit of time, you're going to break down the, the fibers and it's going to become more and yeah. more saucy. And that flavor is going to permeate through the sauce have through you, the water. Have and you then you're worked add... garlic before, though? I've never It's quite interesting it because it was quite awesome. hard when I first started and now it's tending Literally, to Literally, the taste up. is coming out. Yeah, and it's almost you. like it's releasing that flavor into this. Sorry to interrupt you, G, but that no, is but that's exactly spectacular. It. And imagine when you're roasting garlic, that's exactly what happens. The flavors develop. It takes away yeah. some of that intensity and just you get a nuttiness looking exquisite. Dude, now you're going to add your spaghetti. You could probably cook them down a little bit longer, but you, I, I suppose you want the spaghetti, which has been cooked, to kind of cook a little bit longer in that flavor to get the sauces. And again, just like the gnocchi of <laughs> earlier. Gnocchi, one, buddy. Gnocchi. It also absorbs <laughs> all that flavor. So gnocchi obviously absorbing all that flavor. Again, I can imagine the spaghetti here to do exactly the same thing, right? Completely. And then, of course, you're going to add our African gold, which is absolutely exquisite. And you don't want to cook an olive oil too long. It doesn't have the highest smoking point. And something Smart. that is this exquisitely created you don't want to break it down. You want to get all the anti-inflammatory properties that an olive oil has. But with this, it's the flavor, flavor, mm -hmm. flavor. African gold, extra virgin olive oil, perfectly balanced, medium intensity, extra virgin olive oil with a fresh green aromatic fruitiness and a distinct pepperiness that really does underpin it. It's beautiful, perfect for finishing over meats, for veg, for pastas, for bread, for salads especially. African gold is African excellence at its finest. And best part, it is locally produced. It's not only pleasing to the palate, but to the soul as well. And you can yeah, mix in our really pre-cooked mushrooms as well. And there you have it, my friends. I would add a few more lashings of the African gold just because it's beautiful and we absolutely adore yeah. that Yeah, it's something you can profile. literally drizzle on top of almost anything. Yeah. I mean, it really does bring it to life. And it's like that cherry on the top, that golden moment of any dish. Oh, completely, it man. And these, these oils have been cured to create a flavor profile that is unmatched. Phew. And then, of course, you get the health benefits as well. Oh, then yeah. that baby is going to come out into our plate. And right, we are going to simply add and it's pretty hot, so let me some just nice crunchy croutons. Cool the hands down. There we go. Oh, it looks good. Get some of that in there, man. Oh, Yum. Spectacular. <laughs> <laughs> you got enough? Uh, some of it we got into the plate. We finished it off with a little bit of uh, freshly chopped parsley for a little bit of fresh pop and some croutons, and you're on your way. If you want to find this recipe, you can go to expressoshow.com, and if uh, a budget buster is what you need, this is going to seal the deal. Mm. Nicely done.